Hey, what's up, guys? Well, I got some crazy cloud shit pictures that are... These things are just blowing my mind, guys. This is getting absolutely insane. And I even... Today I heard this interview with a, um, an abductee or some sort, and she also uh, was in contact with uh, Stephen Greer, Dr. Greer, and they went on a field trip. And she says, uh, they stood in a circle and held hands, and two ships showed up. They said one hovered above, her, above their heads, and one uh, landed beside them. And the interviewer says, well, you know, what were they? Were they solid? Were, she said they were, actually, they showed up as clouds, she said. And that really struck a chord to me because I've been pushing this cloud ship thing. And it really helped me feel a lot better that someone actually had an experience with these things. But she said one hovered above, one landed beside them, and uh, she said it, it was like holographic and it became more solid, more solid, more solid, and then it became a solid like shiny metal. And that's exactly what we're seeing in the sky here. It looks kind of holographic, really shiny though, when you can see it. It's the same stuff. They lower their vibration. Okay, that can make them make them appear as clouds. Okay, so when they raise their vibration, they become more solid. And uh, yeah, very very crazy stuff. But um, look at this, guys, and that just made me want to show more of this stuff. Look at this. I've seen these around my house, and I called them stacking plates, like. Stacking plates of clouds look exactly like that and I've seen them go like all the way up to the sky Like way where you can't even see the top of them But um, and then on top of that look at the size of this guys in the background look at this thing It goes all the way across All the way. I don't even know where the top is actually. I think it's somewhere around here, but you got compartments in the middle. You could see the grooves all the way through it. I mean, look at this. These are starting to look more solid. You know what I'm saying? It's, look at that. The clouds can't even cover it. It's so big. You got little clouds here, but the structure of the thing is just too ginormous. And then you could clearly see an eyeball up here I mean they got all sorts of, they got like floating cities guys all over the place and I've been thinking about it it's all I think it's all connected with Nibiru too because it's uh, you know you go way back to 2009 when people started seeing that little dot by the Sun okay and then they start the chem trailing okay and then uh and then earthquakes start happening, tsunamis. And now we got big cracks in the ground. And now people are seeing huge red orb-like planets. And these clouds, like I've said over the past couple of years, have just been crazy with the weather. These huge clouds. Because they're ships coming from that system. And I think we have had these around throughout our history at all times. But now that the system's coming around, you got all the inhabitants, it's going to be a lot more coming to check it out and stuff. So, it's pretty wild when you think about it. It really does all connect. If you think about the Nibiru system and when it was first noticed by citizens and then, you know, 10 years later, the, the activity has picked up so much that they can't even hide it anymore. And these clouds, I've noticed, just got, this stuff started coming in a few years ago. I've seen storm clouds and stuff and like crazy, but yeah, it hasn't been this obvious that these are ships. I mean, I've caught so many pictures of them actually spewing out the clouds. Look at this. I mean, look, this is nuts. You got, check it out, you got a pyramid right here. 
You got a pyramid here, a pyramid here. Wow. They got their own pyramids right up here. Look at this. You got one here, and then one up here, and probably another one. Then you got a demon face right in there. And then, uh, yeah, this one's kind of bad, but you can see the saucer-like stuff in there. Anyways, moving on. Look at all this. You can see all the metal work and all the framework. That's nuts. But yeah, that lady in the interview said she did not like Dr. Greer and she saw him, his face, turn to like reptilian. And I'm not a huge fan of Dr. Greer. I just, it was on, uh, what's his name? Uh, Bruce something the gang stalker he's always catching like black helicopters like following him but um, he was interviewing someone and they had told him about a field trip with Dr. Greer and uh, she just felt wrong the whole time she said as soon as she signed the um, non-disclosure agreement uh she said, like, her, she felt this, you know, wrenching in her gut. But she just went anyway, because they even told her that you may be followed by black ops after this field trip. And she said she was. Look at this, guy. Look at that. I mean, plain as day. That is metal. And then little grooves or windows. This is getting outrageous. And I'm so surprised the majority of the public has not picked up on this. I mean, you could sit there and look at the sky like this for a couple, or take a picture of it, look at it for a couple seconds, and notice something is not right. I mean, these are just massive, massive ships. I mean, this thing is ginormous, takes up the entire sky. It's bigger than that city. It is a city. I mean, pretty much you have like pyramids, floating cities with pyramids. Look at all this stuff. Just wild, wild stuff, guys. You know, I sometimes feel pretty scared putting this stuff out, but. They've obviously um, shadow banned a lot of my stuff. They don't let a lot of people see it. That's why I don't have many views at all. But if I could reach two people, I'm happier because I know that I'm at least trying to do my part in getting this stuff out. So whoever wants to listen, I'm welcome to share whatever I have. Look at this. Is that the pilot or something? I mean, that looks almost like a big ship wheel. And then you got this beam right there. But I don't know. It's just crazy, crazy stuff. Look at that. That's just so crazy. But anyways, guys, I wanted to share that with you and, uh, Show you some crazy stuff. Look at this. You got, oops, come on. You got steps going up here. Huh. Leading up to here. And it is, it's like a freaking city. You got these temples and this is a big, like, temple slash alien space station. It, look at this. You got the huge eye. I mean, this is a huge, like, eye window with a tall white right there. Wow, that was a good shot. That is a window with a tall white. 
right here. There's his two eyes. He's in a black suit. He's sitting in something. But when you back up, you can see. I know it's pixelated, but you can kind of see the uh, the bubble of the window with this guy sitting right in the cockpit. Just wild. Yeah, look at this in the background here. Look at the size of these ships. Then you got these rings on them. Look at this. It goes all the way back. Look at this. Comes out here. Oops, sorry guys. But yeah, you can see it. All the way over. All of this stuff. That's what I'm saying. The whole sky is filled with these. These are the watchers. Look at that. Look at this. It's like a big circle opening. Wow. That's one of those bug looking things, dude. You can see the bottom of the belly right there. It's like a bug shell. I've caught these at night. They're weird, weird, weird machines. Wow, yeah, you can see the bottom of the belly. Like a bug's belly. There's little things on the side that probably shoot the clouds out. That's just crazy. Anyways, guys, yeah, I'm going to let you go, but look at this one, too. Beautiful, big ship. I mean, that is, that is like a station. You can almost see a door right here. It looks like a door. Doesn't it? That's a perfectly shaped door. With a pathway going out and around. There's a house in the sky. Anyways, God bless, enjoy, and please share, guys. We need this topic out big time. Make your own channel. Just share as much as you can. I want to see some, some attention on this. At least some answers.